YouTube world, my name is Nicholas Montez, and you're watching my YouTube channel, Nicholas Montez. Welcome back to another YouTube channel video, everybody. I'm so excited to have y'all back here together again. And today we're going to be talking about the newest Netflix film, Vacation Friends. If you're wondering why I'm talking like this, it's because I'm filming this at like 1 o'clock in the morning, almost 2 a.m. Um, just because my video schedule has been weird this weekend, but I'm sure next weekend will be very on track. So I'll be out actually having four days off. Uh, but with that said, let's get started talking about Vacation Friends. Okay, so for me, what I liked about the film with Vacation Friends is that it pretty much feels relatable to the real world of our lives where when it's these this couple that meets people and you're not because like my pe my family my parents they meet people when we're, when we're like going to disney and stuff they meet people um and they talk for a little bit sometimes they get their numbers or instagram but they don't like become friends with them and like friends forever they're just people that are just there to talk to um, but this film kind of felt relatable to that, as that the characters with John Cena and stuff, that two relationship was just so funny, as it's like, like you think they're doing something crazy, but then it's like, like they are the craziest people of all time. Like it's so crazy in the way everything has unfolded. And it's just, it's so weird and it's funny at the same time as they put cocaine in their drinks, and then they also like do all these other weird stuff. Uh, um, and it does have some heart in it. It doesn't have some, it does have some serious moments. So overall, I think it balanced that well, but we do have some bad things to talk about. So let's do that. Let's talk about that. So for me, when I when we get to the bat on this one, I just think that the way the story was kind of handled, not the best premise, and not the best story here. Just the whole specific story on this one just never really made sense to me. It never really made sense of, like, what was this whole premise about anyways? Um, about vacation friends. But like, they repeat jokes that, that was teased that, that was made in the in the in the first half of the movie, and then they continue that, um, and then like other family members they like get attached to these people, and it's just so weird as they're not the main people they should be getting rewarded that the main couple should, um, and it's like it's all these weird scenarios where they like take like all these weird drug things. And I just never really thought of that as a good plot line. So it was a very weird film in the way they did it, but I still kind of liked it. Um, but overall, it's a... Well, actually, I'll play my score in a minute. But before I do, be sure to tell me down below what were your thoughts on Vacation Friends. Did you guys love it? Did you guys hate it? What were you right there in between? Let me know all your thoughts down below in the comment section. With that said, let's get on my scores. So that's it for my scores. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My Instagram is Marvel6, my TikTok is Marvel Fan. If you guys don't understand those names, head to my bad section to see follow me on all social medias. I'm also on Letterbox. It's the same name as Instagram, Marvel underscore six underscore, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.